Last April, Connor Barwin returned to Nippert Stadium, but this time he traded a football uniform for a cap and gown. He's one of several student athletes that have returned to campus to finish up school and get a degree. Another recent returnee, Kevin Euclid. Both of them jumped at it immediately once we showed them, here's what can happen, here's what your part in it would be. It wasn't overwhelming for each of them, but it was clear to, both, to us that both of them, this was really important to them. The first time I knew I was coming here to leave to go play in the NBA, this time I'm here to get my degree. So. Dermar Johnson has also returned to campus, but his story is a bit different. In 1999, when he was a freshman, everyone knew the high school All-American would only be on campus for two semesters. So now, 20 years later, he's back to finish up what he started, but unlike the others, he has more than just a few hours to make up. There are very few individuals that are out there uh, across the country that would have DeMar's story. He has been so dedicated to his schooling, Along with taking 15 to 18 credit hours each semester, DeMar is also helping the basketball program because ultimately he wants to get into coaching. But he brings more than just basketball knowledge. He brings a message to all the student athletes. You know, enjoy this while you're here, but it's going to end. Not everybody's going to go pro. And even if you do go pro, that's going to end. So at that point, what do you do? And you know, having, a, having that degree, and you know, take advantage of the education you're getting here for free so you know you can set yourself up for later. Times have changed since 1999 and so have the priorities. Athletes may still leave early, but now there's a plan. We've worked really hard over the last uh, you know, 10 years to really put those student athletes, a lot of times coaches have identified or shared with us this individual may have a professional opportunity. So we have targeted summer school, we've targeted different programming ideas with those students so that they leave in the best case scenario. When you're that young, you think basketball is going to last forever. I, I thought I'd still be playing in NBA right now, and but you, you, don't, you don't think that far ahead.